Is XRP the next big thing in the cryptocurrency world, like Bitcoin? Is it possible that XRP will also create a new generation of millionaires overnight? And if that's the case, how exactly will Ripple make its backers rich? Hey there, everyone thank you for visiting Crypto Aussie, your one-stop shop for all things XRP and cryptocurrency related. On this video, we'll discuss how XRP can make you an overnight millionaire in the near future. As a result, pay attention and stay focused. The best method to stay up to date with our uploads is to subscribe to the channel, hit the bell, and enable post alerts. This way, you'll never miss an upload from us again. That being said, let's get started on what we'll be talking about today. To begin, the United Arab Emirates has set its eyes on digital currencies such as Bitcoin. With a focus on 2023 to 2026, the UAE central bank is poised to move rapidly. Want to be one of the top 10 central banks in the world? The creation of a digital currency is also one of the goals. The UAE's financial services sector is undergoing a digital transformation thanks to the newest artificial intelligence and big data solutions, which are being utilized. Technology will be used in areas including inspection, monitoring, and insurance, and the UAE's digital ID infrastructure will be tapped to help promote financial inclusion. Strategy is designed to help the UAE with its green economy efforts while also working to improve the country's competitiveness in this area by building up a more creative financial infrastructure. The UAE Centennial 2071 aims to make the UAE the best country on earth. The Future Expectations and Needs of Partners survey was launched by KI. The Central Bank of the United Arab Emirates, KI, aims to be one of the world's top 10 central banks by 2026, according to a three-year plan released with the debut of the country's digital currency. He has set seven goals to aid in the digital transformation of the country. The desire to work in the financial services industry. This transition, according to Gulf News, would be greatly influenced by artificial intelligence and big data technologies currently in development. UAE Innovation Strategy aims to streamline inspection, monitoring and insurance systems by using technology, However, the government will use the UAE Pass, a digital identity system to track citizens to bolster financial inclusion and easy access to finance services, to streamline the strategy. Staying true to the green economy's goal of global fintech disruption. The UAE government's Vision 2021 calls for the creation of a safe cloud infrastructure for To maintain a culture of creativity, it is necessary to For more information on Peace Survey, Check out their Future Expectations and Needs of Partner survey, which was launched recently, according to Gulf News. Despite the fact that many Gulf countries have already said that they are open to, the UAE is the first regulatory body to express an interest in digital technologies like cloud computing and mobile payments. A predetermined timetable. As part of his wider e-government development agenda, Vietnamese Prime Minister PHM and CHNH said earlier this month that he was open to testing a virtual currency. The Vietnamese government, on the other hand, had previously prohibited the use of Bitcoin BTC, as a form of payment. Even so, individuals can continue to invest in Bitcoin with little fear of regulatory repercussions. Privately, Governments around the world are re-evaluating the use case for Bitcoin and its direct consequences for the transfer of political power as its position in mainstream banking groups. Collaboration between Ripple and FinFan FinFan has confirmed that Ripple has worked with them. A platform for cross-border money movement, FinFan aids service providers in rapidly growing their businesses. Remittances and payment services to untapped markets are available. For money beyond borders, becoming key partners in the Vietnamese market will result in an all-encompassing solution. As of March 31, 2020, Ripple, the enterprise blockchain platform, established a partnership with FinFan to provide a global payment solution. Since FinFan will join Ripple's global financial payments network, RippleNet, which includes more than 300 financial institutions across the world, international money transfers will be more cost-effective, as fees and exchange rates will be lower. In addition, the cross-border money transfer fintech has just announced a new relationship with RippleNet will be used for cross-border transfers for the first time by FinFan, according to the company. The majority of Vietnamese people living abroad. Additionally, a solution to reduce on-demand transaction fees, 
a more transparent manner of exchange, a real-time bridge between many currencies, and immediate settlement will be developed in collaboration with the agreement. By making it possible for clients to send money anywhere in the world at any time, this might transform the remittance sector. In the country of Vietnam, Ripple is strengthening the general growing momentum of the fintech business. It will enhance its market position by implementing blockchain technology to build a comprehensive financial system. Ripple's global payment solutions are safer and faster because of the work of the company's partners. Research, education, and charity are all areas in which Ripple is eager to invest, and the company is happy to be a part of such a significant worldwide initiative. FinFan believes it will become a unicorn in the future and be at the forefront of financial technology if it becomes a strategic partner of Ripple in Vietnam. FinFan's founder and CEO, Win Tuyen, said, Ripple's ideals are a source of pride for the financial technology industry. Ripple is more than just a financial institution, it represents the direction of fintech in the future. With the opportunity to collaborate with Ripple, FinFan can create a payment and money transfer platform in the corridor to a significant degree. FinFan's primary mission is to help people all around the world by facilitating the transfer of money. With a blockchain infrastructure that facilitates cash-in and cash-out transactions. FinFan is one of the pioneers in Vietnam's digital banking revolution, according to the company. The most important players. It redraws the financial landscape in Vietnam by being the country's first non-bank institution to use RippleNet. It will redraw boundaries by making cross-border transactions more efficient and accessible. From into the United States capital. NFTs have piqued Ripple's interest as well. When Ripple Labs first entered the NFT world in July, it joined Mintable, which is an NFT exchange. Since then, the company has raised a total of $13 million in funding. The corporation is now ramping up its efforts to keep pace with the non-fungible market's rapid expansion. A tokenized future has been made possible by NFTs, yet understanding these notions is still tough. Is a completely different story for many people. By starting with marketplaces and creators on the XRP ledger, our fund aims to remove the guesswork from NFT initiatives, thereby unlocking new tokenization uses. As new revenue sources and business models emerge, NFTs hold the potential to help creators better connect with the people and things that matter to them. When it comes to through our fund, we hope to assist in attracting new, high-profile NFT innovators and businesses. NFT sales volumes have surpassed $2.5 billion in the first half of this year, and the new digital tokens are becoming increasingly popular around the world. Bhutan and Ripple have formed a partnership. In addition, Ripple is working with Bhutan to provide assistance. Price increases of approximately 15% occurred after the Asian nation established its own CBDC. The Royal Monetary Authority of Bhutan has created a collaboration with Ripple to test its own digital currency as a central bank. When it comes to the distributed ledger, Ripple is employing its own technology to help guide the process. This year, the XRP ledger's popularity has skyrocketed due in large part to the fact that it is energy efficient and its CBDC technology is both trustworthy and cost-effective. Yangchen Shogiel, Bhutan's Royal Monetary Authority's Deputy Governor, stated, associating with each other. The success of Ripple demonstrates the potential of CBDCs to provide a viable alternative payment instrument in Bhutan. Through the revolutionary technology developed by Ripple, a CBDC will be able to test new ideas. With the new payments infrastructure, we will make it easier for our customers to send money across borders with no question, Ripple is progressing. After starting as a cross-border payments platform, Ripple is now offering tokenized services, giving businesses access to crypto capabilities and putting them on the right path for the future. Where cryptocurrencies are prominently displayed. Originally, the goal of RippleNet was to address the issues of transaction speed, low transaction costs, and complete transparency. International payments for those who aren't well served by the existing banking system. Sending money across borders costs the typical consumer 7% of the amount sent, or $14. Since the 2008 financial crisis, fewer banks have extended money to small and medium-sized enterprises, making it more difficult for these companies to obtain further working capital loans. In addition, payments to foreign suppliers, employees, 
or other important partners may be delayed can have a negative impact on these companies. With RippleNet, mid-sized banks and payment service providers can better compete, are not burdened with prohibitive transaction costs, and don't have to wait for payment delivery days to be delivered to their customers. When, then, should traders and investors begin buying Ripple? Investors, according to many, can expect to make large returns in the future. Vertical bar. Disclaimer. Prices may have changed since making this video. We are not a licensed financial advisor. All videos on this channel are intended for entertainment purposes only. You should not buy, sell, trade, or invest in any asset based on what we say in these videos. You should know that investing carries extreme risks. You could lose your entire investment. This is not trading advice, and we are in no way liable for any losses incurred. Beware of scammers, we will never ask you for money over WhatsApp or any other service. Do not click on anything, comments, or emails that pretend to be from US. Please report all scams and imposters to YouTube.